in this video I'm going to look at how to transfer money between accounts in Zero, where those accounts are in different currencies to one another. The example I'm using is an AUD PayPal account and a USD PayPal account and we're going to do a transfer from the Aussie dollar PayPal to the US dollar PayPal accounts and then I'm going to show the ex an expense being paid out of that US dollar PayPal account. Before I go on, um, to utilise multi-currency in Zero, you must have the large Zero subscription. If you have anything less than that, and the multi-currency functionality is not available. The starting point for this example is that in the Aussie dollar PayPal account, there's $2,000 balance and there's zero US dollars held. So the first thing I'm going to do is go into the reconcile screen for the Aussie dollar PayPal account. Here you can see on 9th of January it's notated two US dollar. So this amount of Aussie dollars has transferred across to the US dollar account. Click on transfer select the bank account, it's to the US dollar PayPal account. Now unlike in a previous video I've done where I process transfers, in this one you also need to enter a conversion because we're moving from one currency to another. Now because I know what the um, target currency is and how many dollars of the target currency we need, I know this is a thousand dollars. To view that I can just go into the US dollar account and have a look at the bank statement line. If I click OK here, that line's now disappeared so that's reconciled and with a starting balance of 2000 and spending a little over 989 Aussie dollars, we're down to a balance of a thousand and ten Aussie dollars. Going into the US dollar PayPal account now. You can see here this bank statement line showing a deposit of a thousand US dollars exactly matches what we just entered into zero from the Aussie dollar PayPal account. So I can just OK this. And now you can see here there's a thousand US dollar software subscription paid to a US company. So I'm going to create a transaction to allocate this expense. I'm going to just call it a general expense and it's going to be no GST because it's a foreign purchase. I'm going to OK that and now if I go back to the dashboard you'll see that both accounts are fully reconciled. What was 2000 Aussie dollars is now down to just a little bit over a thousand dollars because the Aussie dollar is a bit stronger than the US dollar. It only took something less than a thousand Aussie dollars to make the thousand dollar US dollar purchase. Transferring between accounts in zero where there's multi-currency can get a little bit confusing and the feeds can be sometimes difficult to set up. If you do need any help please uh, don't hesitate to uh, contact me on my website easyonlinebookkeeping.com.au